And right now it's time for that time when we have our special guest. Tonight's special guest is our second and first place winners at the 50 plus Coloba National Karaoke Championship. After 24 weeks and 20 contestants, it all came down to our top three, Charlie Davis, Rob Innes and Helen Rowe. Tonight we talk to Rob and Helen. We welcome first and second place winners, Rob Innes and Helen Rowe as our special guests on The Beat Goes On. Welcome to The Beat Goes On, Rob Innes, our second place Thank you very much, winner. Jared. Great to be with you. Of the Coloba National Karaoke Championship. It was a great night. Yeah. It was you, a lot of fun. What a beautiful singer you are, Rob. Oh, thank you very much for that. Now, when can you remember that you loved music and you wanted to be a singer? Oh, I think I started singing around about the age of four, Jared. Yeah. Um, when I was just a tiny tot, of course, and uh, sang my very first song. Put another nickel in. Remember that one, the Nickelodeon? Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember that one? <laughs> can we have two verses, please? <laughs> Now, I anyway, the, the thing is that uh, I was on Studio One, the, uh, the big song contest where we had um, our song, Le More L'Enfant de Liberté, ah, and yes. of course you were there at the same time, weren't you? So uh, tell us about that time in you. you. Yeah, that was... As a young man, you were... 1969. Yeah. Oh, no, that was a couple of years. Yeah, a couple of years before us. That's yeah. right. Yeah. No, that was an amazing experience, Jared. I, mm. um, I'd sort of really wanted to sing all my life and never really had the courage to get out and... Mm have a go at something and uh, then this opportunity came along and I thought, yeah, why not, why not? So uh, I uh, sang two songs on the competition and uh, managed to get through to the final, which was wow. awesome. Uh, but that was the year Hogsnort Rupert came right. flying in and took oh. the title. So great, great band, <laughs> great band. <laughs> Yeah, it's all good, all a bit hazy now, isn't it? Um, yeah, I mean, it is a little um, bit hazy. Now, but there was a stage there, uh, Rob, that you were telling me uh, before we uh, came on the, the air that um, you actually went off singing there for a while. Uh, yeah, purely because of nerves. You know, I just used to get so nervous. I, you know, I was physically sick, Jared, before I went on stage. And really, and you know, I came up to Auckland, was invited to come and sing at Logan Park, which was one of the places yes, at the it time, was, wasn't it? Yeah, and uh, there were a whole lot of overseas tourists there from America and all over the place and I was uh, doing a week's residency there and every night I got out you know my legs just wouldn't stop shaking oh. my voice came out okay mm. but it was the legs you know yeah. so if any of you been watching my legs yeah. the knees were knocking together and look after a while I just used to get so sick of that feeling that, that, that I decided feeling. to walk away from it mm. for uh, it was nearly about 25 years so oh. yeah what the, what what was that? What what causes nerves to, oh, to that look, degree? Yeah, I think it's it, it really is just worrying what people will think. Do, mm. Can I sing or can't mm. I? Ah, it's strange to think that you have uh, you had those nerves, Rob, with such a wonderful voice. Because what we're going to do now is play a little bit of uh, your song from last week from the karaoke championship, oh, right. which is absolutely beautiful. And I'm st saying to you, Rob, how could you have doubted yourself with such a great piece? Thank you. <laughs> Let's have a listen. Some say love, it is a river that drowns the tender reed. Some say love, it is a razor that leaves your soul to bleed. Some say love, it is a hunger, an endless aching need. I say love, it is a flower, and you, it's only seed. It's the heart afraid of breaking That never learns to dance It's the dream afraid of waking That never takes the chance it's the one who won't be taken Who cannot seem 
to give And the soul Afraid of dying That never Learns to live Loved it. Beautiful voice, beautiful voice. Thank you, Jared. What's the demand for a man that sings such beautiful songs around New Zealand today? What, what's, what sort of demand is there? There, are, there is a demand. Um, there are lots, of course, of the baby boomers that yeah. love to hear the music from the 50s, 60s and 70s, and that's exactly what I sing. Mm -hmm. A whole range of up-tempo, a bit of rock and roll, a bit of jazz, yeah. a bit of country, a bit of everything. I but like to give people a, a mix. But so, we really hear you in those ballads, don't uh, we? The ballads are what I really enjoy probably the most. Mm -hmm. I think um, my voice enjoys ballads yeah. the most. Now your voice has got that great timber, so well, how old are you today, uh, Rob? Are we allowed to ask? Well, or, uh, today I'm 62. 62. Soon I'll be 63. <laughs> oh, great. Now what I'm saying is the voice holding up. You've, it's, it's, you it's, wake up every morning and it's it, just as good as well, the last day? Or? It is quite amazing because yeah. I've just finished doing a 12 concert tour just mm. recently. 12 nights almost all in a row, two hours each night, just on my own singing. And I thought halfway through, you know, this is... Uh, this is going to sound strange at the end. I'm not sure what's going to come out, but you know, my voice held up right, right the way through, through. Yeah. and um, it is just a, it's a real blessing to have that. Yeah. And I'm so grateful that I can sing the way I can sing at this age. So mm. I'd like to encourage anybody that's yes. over the age of 50 yeah. uh, on look, the right side of it. It's never too late because <laughs> yeah. you know I've, I've sort of had a dream come true even in my 50s. Recorded my first album. Mm. Um, Got signed to EMI, Virgin Music. Now that's, as they told me, they said that's practically unheard of mm. for somebody in their 50s, you know. Wow. And uh, so that was a great thing. Um, mm. And so I just encourage people, Jared, don't ever give up. You know, it doesn't matter how old you are, how young you are. If you've got a dream, you've go for it, yeah. and eventually it'll get there. Great. Now, if anybody would like to uh, hear Rob Innes, of course, um, around the country, and uh, there's thousands that would. So. You have a website. It's a That's great right. website. It's got everything there. Tell us, mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about the website. Uh, the website has, uh, yeah, it's got um, fairly easy to follow. Mm -hmm. um, at least my wife thinks it is. <laughs> <laughs> She's pretty au fait with it. Um, but you can go in there and see a little bit about my history, you know, about my story. There are some music samples on there, um, some photographs from the past and from the present. And also there is a um, section, we've got an online shop as well, so people can purchase the CDs. Oh, great. So we've got yeah. four different CDs there with some of the great songs from the 50s, 60s and 70s. So and, uh, dub, dub, dub. Dot Rob Innes Music mm. dot co dot NZ. Too simple. Yeah. Too simple, isn't yeah, it? Just it is. <laughs> get on there and uh, order some CDs. For those of them that haven't got the facility of online, of course, they can phone 09237. 8157. That's 237 8157. And uh, we'll be quite happy to send them out a CD in the mail. And uh, Or if they want a booking, Jared, for a birthday party yeah. or an anniversary, I'll be quite happy to come and sing the good music for them. Oh, they have. You're, you're wonderful. Rob Innes, thank you very wonderful. much. Thank you for being on the show. Thanks you're very much for inviting me.